Hi, my name is Carl, and I'm the creator of Car Care, an iOS app for fuel economy and automobile maintenance. Let me show you as much of my great app as I can in three minutes. When you load it up the first time, you'll see a plus sign in the top right. You can tap it to add a new vehicle, and I'm going to pretend I have a BMW 5 Series. And let's make it really new. The app supports miles or kilometers, and you can assign whatever kind of photo you'd like of your car, if you have one. And here I have a nice little photo of a BMW. Now let's add one more vehicle. Let's pretend that I had a Yamaha motorcycle. Oh, I don't see Yamaha on the list. Ah, but it's unlisted, so I'll tap to add one. So I'll type in Yamaha, save that, and now it shows up. I can add any type of car that I'd like. So I'll add a Yamaha motorcycle, an R1, and we'll uh, say it's also in miles, but I don't have a photo of it, so it uses a default image. Now let's enter our first fuel entry. We'll just tap the new fuel entry icon here, and we can enter in any kind of odometer that we, that we need. So let's pretend we've driven 4,000 miles in this. And let's enter whatever the fuel price is, and then the quantity that we filled. Now you can enter any type of quantity, either gallons or liters. It works all around the world. So let's go ahead and save it. Car Care geotags your entries if you like it to. And now we'll enter a second fuel entry because you need two fuel entries to calculate your fuel economy. So this time we'll enter in a couple different numbers. We can still keep it as gallons for now. And all of a sudden, boom, there's our fuel economy. Nice and easy, no hassle to calculate it. And you can get any type of fuel economy, liters per hundred kilometers, kilometers per liter, and even uh, the UK mile per gallon. Uh, you've also got a few different options, such as geotagging, sharing it, and the full tank, uh, where you can mark it whether it's a full tank or not. You can change the date by tapping on the date, and you can see what the total price is to check that your fuel is actually costing what you think it should. Let's add one more fuel entry quick, and let's say we're entering super fuel. We can actually change it to any type of fuel if we need a diesel or something, but let's say it's super, and we'll... Uh, We'll enter in nine gallons, I guess. And in fact, let's enter in something different. Let's go 20 liters because we can do that. We can mix liters with, uh, with, gal with gallons in the same car and still get correct gas mileage. And, you know, maybe it was uh, this much. So now we've got, wow, a lot better fuel economy all of a sudden. That's okay. And it even shows a pit stop timer. I'll show you that. And that'll, that's for another time. I'll explain that in a different video. But we can see now with the fuel graphs, hey, fuel economy has been recorded. And I'm pretty much done with my three minutes, but let's go into a little bit of overtime. Here's the vehicle stats. You can see that you have a lot of different uh, interesting statistics here, including what your total fuel cost is, how much it's cost per gallon overall, and then your uh, fuel cost per mile how far you've driven, and then it even gives you averages for uh, different types of fuel. Now, it hasn't been able to calculate the super yet, but it does know for regular what the fuel economy is. So it's got some very, uh, very interesting uh, stats that would not necessarily be easy to calculate on your own. Now, you can share these stats by email or something else, and you can also look at them on a map so you can see where you're filling up your fills. And uh, you can uh, also set reminders for your vehicle. Oil change, tire rotation, you can change them to whatever you want. And you can uh, import data from the website. You can also email all of your entries out. So if you want to send them somewhere, there you go. And finally, I'll show you entering some maintenance because that's really important. We can enter in an oil change of any sort. Uh, and, you know, let's just enter it. Let's say we entered it at 3400 We can enter in whatever the price was. And go ahead and save it. And now it's in there. You can also add any type of reminder or service entry, too. If I want to remind myself to, uh, you know, fill washer fluid, I can do that. So I'll just choose fill washer fluid, and I'll check every 5000 Sounds good. And uh, now we're set. And it tells us how far we are away from all these different entries. Hope you've enjoyed it. I went over three minutes. I went a lot over three minutes. But I hope this gives you a good idea of what all is in car care. Be sure to contact me uh, at the website or on Twitter. And there's a 
bunch of other uh, videos at carlbecker.com slash carcare slash videos. Thanks a lot for watching. I really hope you enjoy the app.